Tonight, the vice mayor of Paradise is in trouble with the law. He was arrested on Tuesday after investigators say he sent inappropriate texts and lewd pictures to what he thought was a 16-year-old girl. Action News Now's Vanessa Romo joins us now. And Vanessa, I know you spoke with people in Paradise today. What did they tell you? They were shocked, Alan. One person told me he's a family friend and was very surprised at what investigators say happened. I'm very shocked about hearing about the vice mayor. Every time I went gone to a town meeting or been where he's at, he's always conducted himself like a gentleman. Folks in paradise concerned and surprised over the allegations against vice mayor Mike Zuccalillo. So bad for his family. I know that he has a wife and kids. And um, the people that trusted him in the town of paradise. In a statement by Mayor Greg Bolin, it says, quote, the Paradise Town Council is also surprised to learn of the arrest. Investigators say a man told them he posed as a 16-year-old girl and targeted the vice mayor. This after the man apparently had some sort of bad business deal with Zuccalillo. Detectives, the FBI, and the DA's office took over the investigation. They say Zuccalillo kept sending lewd pictures and text messages. Just it made me upset because I've got daughters and I'm a high school teacher. So it made me think about my students and if he was doing that to my students. One councilwoman said if a council member is convicted of a felony, they can be removed from office. That remains to be seen. We reached out to Zicalillo and he says, quote, he will have a statement soon, however, not at this time. Vanessa Romo, Action News Now. Thank you, Vanessa. And Zuccalillo turned himself in on Tuesday. He's now out on $135,000 bail, facing several charges.